Thanks for watching. And here's a super neat trick problem I found on Twitter. And here the trick or trig is simply to recognize that cosine squared is one minus sine squared x. So in other words, this problem just becomes ad1 to the sine squared x plus ad1 to the one minus sine squared x equals 30. So in particular, let y be sine squared x. So remember this for later. Then this problem just becomes ad1 to the y plus ad1 to the 1 minus y equals to 30. And how about we multiply both sides by ad1 to the y. Then this becomes ad1 to the y plus y, so 2y. This is then just becomes ad1. And then we get 30 times ad1 to the y which actually becomes a quadratic equation weirdly if you simply let z be ad1 to the y because then this becomes z squared this is ad1 and this is 30z and so we can rearrange this to become z squared minus 30z plus 81 equals 0. And the cool thing is this turns out we can factor this quite nicely because then this just becomes, I believe, z minus 3 times z minus 27 equals 0. So, sorry, I did have to use Wolfram Alpha for this. But so I solved it. So then we get either z equals 3 or z equals 27. So that gives us z and now we just have to go back and solve for y and then go back and solve for x. So what we get is 81 to the y equals 3 but then 81 it's 3 to the fourth so 3 to the 4y equals 3 to the 1. So 4y equals 1. So y equals to 1 fourth. Or same spiel with 27. So 81 to the y equals 27. So 3 to the 4y equals 3 cubed. So 4y equals 3. So y is 3 fourths. Okay, very good. So now we solve for y and now we just need to solve for x. So in the case of y equals 1 fourth, we have sine squared x equals 1 fourth. So sine of x is plus minus 1 half. On the other hand, sine squared x is 3 quarters. So sine of x is plus minus square root of 3 over 2. And then what does that look like on the trig circle? Well, sine of x equals 1 half. I believe that is 30 degrees. So pi over 6. Sine of x is square root of 3 over 2. That gives us 60 degrees. And then the symmetric values here, 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 here. And if you think about this, it's all the val multiples of pi over 6, except 0, pi over 2, pi, and 3 pi over 2. Again, up to multiples of 2 pi. So I believe all this is, is just me, pi m over 6, except m cannot be a multiple of 3. So m is not equal to 0 mod 3 because multiples of 3 that would give you pi over 2 pi 3 pi over 2 and 2 pi and in fact I believe yeah there should be 8 of them between 0 and 2 pi just like here all right I hope you like this if you want to see more math please make sure to subscribe to our channel thank you very much